हरे कृष्णा बिफोर कृष्णा कैन एंट्रांस आवर कॉन्शियसनेस ही नीड्स एन एंट्रेंस टू आवर कॉन्शियसनेस वेन वी ट्राई टू कनेक्ट विथ कृष्णा और वेन वी ट्राई टू कनेक्ट अदर्स विथ कृष्णा एट दैट टाइम वी हैव टू नो दैट डिवोशन इज एन इंक्रीमेंटल प्रोग्रेशन Ultimately, the purpose of devotion is to offer our heart, to offer our consciousness, to offer our entire being to Krishna. But often there are people who may not even believe in the existence of God. What to speak of? Dedicate their existence to God. So when people are so far away from God, at that time we need to speak about Him in a way that is appropriate for them. otherwise they will simply get alienated if people who don't believe in the existence of god are talked are told about his intimate glories then they will just start thinking this is just a elaborate imagination of people who are sentimental and gullible that's why we see in the bhagavad gita towards the end after speaking the whole gita and concluding it krishna gives a cautionary note in 18.67 he states that <clears throat> don't speak this knowledge to those who are envious those who do not have a service attitude <clears throat> he says that if we speak this knowledge to them they will simply get agitated their animosity their envy will increase so, <clears throat> so the important point here to understand is not that krishna wants to deprive those people of that knowledge his purpose is actually to get them to rise to that level gradually in the earlier third chapter he has said that we should speak in a way that doesn't agitate people's minds he says <coughs> that don't disturb the minds of people who are attached and ignorant that rather than agitate na buddhi bhedam janayet agyanam karma sanginam joshayet sarva karmani vidwan yukta samacharan that the wise people don't agitate people's minds but gradually engage them on the progressive path of spiritual elevation so if somebody is not ready right now to hear about god's confidential glories then we can just open their minds about the possibility of spirituality even if it is generic spirituality maybe there is something more to life why do we look for meaning why do we long for eternal life what is the purpose of life so by speaking to people according to the level that they are at first we need to give people an ent- people's consciousness this entrance entrance for krishna and gradually as krishna enters there is a slight openness to spirituality then from there they will grow gradually grow and then eventually they'll come to the level of becoming entranced by krishna absorbed in him that is krishna's desire and that's why after giving the cautionary note in 18.67 where krishna says that yeah don't speak this to everyone then in next two verses he says those who share this knowledge with others they become very dear to me but he wants this knowledge to be shared in a way that people become attracted to him not alienated from him so by understanding who can be entranced by krishna we speak about krishna's confidential glories to them and by understanding who need just an entrance to their consciousness to krishna we can speak preliminary spiritual knowledge by which they can open their minds to higher spiritual reality thank you hare krishna